the outcome of the Eurasia Cup match in Kuala Lumpur was never really in doubt with Team Europe taking a handsome 9-3 lead into the final day 12 singles. In the end, they won it very quickly with four wins in the first four matches. Ian Poulter contributing the first point for Team Europe with this birdie putt at 15 on his way to a 4-3 win over Danny Chia. The crucial winning point actually came in the match between Danny Willett and Ben Ann. Ann needed to hold this chip at the 17th to keep the match alive. And when he wasn't able to do that, it uh, underlined Danny Willett's 3-1 victory. And that was the crucial point which ensured that Europe would win the Eurasia Cup. It was a day when Asia were able to win only two matches, one of them coming from Anuban Lahiri with this birdie putt at the 17th on his way to a 2 and one win over Shane Lowry. At least a win at the end of a disappointing week for Lahiri. Lee Westwood, though, was in superb form, holding this huge long putt at the fourth early on, and he really did dominate his match against Nicholas Fung of Team Asia winning seven and six in the end. But all credit to the youngest man in the Eurasia Cup, Wang yong hoon who birdied at the last to ensure a half point in his match against Ross Fisher. Soren Kelton was able to contribute another point for Europe, this birdie at the 16th, confirming his victory against Priyad Mark Tang in the bottom match. In the end, it could hardly have been more convincing. 18 and a half, five and a half, the final score, and European team captain accepted the trophy from the Malaysian Prime Minister. Terrific performance all week. Congratulations to Team Europe, the Eurasia Cup champions.